What the hell is this? Hey guys, today I'll show you how to solve the 4x4 Rubik's Cube PL parody with no algorithms. Before we start, make sure you make the subscribe button gray as I make a new cubing content every single day. And make sure you leave some suggestions on what you want to see. Alright, once we got that out of the way, let's get started with PL parody. So PL parody can either look like this, 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 or this. So basically cases you would not find on a 3x3 on PLO stage. But fear no more, because it only takes 6 moves to get this back into a 3x3 familiar case. These 6 moves will work anywhere on an unfamiliar case on PLO, and I'll show you that right now. So it's really easy to remember. It's kind of kind of like a H-perm, but with uh, these inner layers. So what you want to do is first off, move these two layers together twice. And I also put the algorithm on top, but uh, I would... It's easier to remember without the algorithm. So turn it twice. You want to move this middle layer twice. And then spin the top, just the top, twice. Move this middle layer twice again. So I'm saying it's kind of like the H-perm. Spin it twice. Move the, this layer twice. And move the two layers like this twice. And there you have it. You should have a solved cube or a, now a familiar 3x3 uh, three three PLO case. One little cool tip I can give you is um, when you have PLO parity, you can... You can force it into a good PL after you solve it. So, for example, in this case, um, if, for example, I do uh, the parity algorithm or the moves here, I'll get a not so good case. I'll get an F perm. But if I do it here, I'll get a T perm because these two edges swap. I'll show you right now. So, and now we have a T perm. So there are some positives of uh, PL parity, as you can forge a, a better PL after you solve the parity. And this is for the people that do prefer algorithms, which I'll just still show you because, uh, yeah, in case some people like algorithms. So uh, here's the algorithm on top, and I'll follow it. And there you have it. So I hope you learned something new and learned a new algorithm to help you on 4x4. Make sure you like the video if this worked, and share it to your friends that don't know parody. Alright, that's it for this video. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.